Hey, I'm Just Vosco and this is Just Gear City. Now, as you can see, we are actually making money. Not a lot of money, but a little bit of money. Um, construction still around £1 million, um, which has got one month to go. We skipped forward a little bit. I have done a chassis. I'll explain that in a bit. And then we've got two months on our coupe, two plus two, and eight months on our van. Now, there's a few things I want to get done in this episode. So let's skip forward two months till our new vehicle's out. Like so. Um, we've got this contract. They wish to renew the contract. Is that right? Yes. Um, they're paying us... Uh, unit payment 4.5 thousand and each unit is costing us what? Unit payment, unit needs 50, oh, we'll do it. They're paying us a lot more than what we're paying for that item anyway. What vehicle is it? The Swift. Uh, so we're going to renew that one. Uh, the Swift is very popular. Just through contracts alone, we're selling 590 Swift. Is it, I presume it's through contacts alone. Let's have a look. Uh, yes, yeah, Swift, 415 there. So that's doing really nicely. Now, we've got our new vehicle available. So if we go to um, branches, uh, we're going to go to the Sam X. We are going to apply to all. It's going to be cost 2,337. <laughs> so there we go. We've applied to all. So that should come in here somewhere. The Sam X has got an overall rating of 37. Uh, so 40 and 37. And it's massively cheaper than anything else on the market. Hugely cheaper. And pretty much okay, actually. That fits in really nicely. Um, let's have a look at the review. I'm going to say it's probably rubbish. Probably. We'll see. Let's go to Sam X. We're going to go down here. Um, some may be able to point to other coupe 2 plus 2s and say this is better, this is prettier, this is the best coupe 2 plus 2. But they would be wrong because beauty is in the eye of the beholder. Behold the JR Motors JR Sam X. It may not be everything for everyone, but it is certainly something for someone. I have no idea if that's good or bad. Um, let's see on the track. On the track... Um, after a morning of coffee and drawing straws, I was chosen, uh, one to take the blah 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 out. Uh, what have we got? X is a real sleeper. Literally, they, they will, will put you to sleep. Oh, oh dear. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. So we may not sell many of those. We definitely need to get better engines. Uh, I really want to go into sports a lot more. Um, we do have our new factory now. So let's open a few more... A few more um, branches. I think that's a great idea. Somewhere to shift our products. So we're going to copy the London branch as always. There we go. Um, you've got one million people. I reckon we can open a branch there as well. So let's do that. We'll copy our London one. Uh, how many people have you got? Half a million. I'm only going for large populations at the minute. We'll open a branch in uh, Vienna. Uh, London, thank you. Uh, what else have we got? N almost a million, maybe there. You've definitely got a, min a million. Urgh. Just clicking on all the little dots to see what we've got. Can I click you on you? No, you're no good. Uh, hello? Nope. 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 Oh, 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 Barcelona. Let's open a branch in Barcelona. Uh, London build branch. What have we got up here? Small amounts of people. Oh, then that's good. We could go into Denmark, so let's open a branch there, and I think that will do for the time being. Um, let's go back to the office. We're going to skip forward one month just to see if that made any difference to sales. No, we made £1.7 million loss. Wow. Oh, that's from construction. If you take that off, we'd have actually have made a small, tiny profit. Uh, we are making sales. Not many, but some. Every little helps. Let's have a look at what our contracts are looking like. We've got some contracts. Is there any more contracts we can take? So let's go to the R&D department. We're going to go contracts. 
Um, vehicles, even though I'm going to change it to all once I'm in here. You are after one of these. You're willing to pay three, five, three, eight, five. You want 80 per month. If we offer you that one, that's cheaper to us to produce and we make more money on it. So we're going to submit that offer. Um, you want what? Is that the engine you want? Yes. So we're going to submit that offer. Um, they will need 35 per month. That's fine. They're going to need 35 per month. We're going to offer them the Gable X. We're going to say... Let's be greedy. Let's go... Huh, what are we... We're not, 3966. Uh, there we go. We're going to submit that. And that's all we can do at the moment. So let's go back to office. I wish to... I'm thinking. I'm thinking we can do a marquee. Is that how you say it? Marquee? Yeah, I'm going to say that. Uh, which is... Uh, let me read it. Uh, this will put up the marquee management panel. It is here we can create new marquees or spin-off. Sell or create independent companies out of the existing marquees we own and operate. I think we should make one. And then we can do it. Because if you look at our overall image, luxury image, fantastic. Quality image, great. Racing image, fantastic. Overall prestige, fantastic. I'm thinking we could do an upper class. Like I really want JR Motors to be the car for everyone. The car of the people sort of thing. So we can do like a sports marquee, do you think? Should we have a look? Let's do it. Um, logo, let's have a look. I quite like that logo, in all fairness. Um, oh, I can't actually see as I'm clicking on them. That's not annoying at all. Violet. No. Although, Titan. No, that's boring. That's boring. Three bars, boring. Oh, the snake's quite nice. Bit over the top, maybe. Um, Scott. Scottish. Uh, red oval, red oval. Radio. Nope. Penta? No. Her. Ochrone. Orange oval. Okay, that's not bad. That's rubbish. Um, that's all right. What's the Norse? No. Ooh. Oh, that's like a weird bug thing. Um, no. No. Have we done all of these? Oh, that's all right. Not getting anything that's jumping out at me in a minute. Four corners, chrome. No. Eclipse, new. Jewel yellow, nope. Cycle, oh, we could have the Bernie. The Bernie could be something. Do you know, I don't hate that second one, that one there. Don't hate that at all. Um, let's call it, what are we? We're JR Motors. Um, let's call this JR Swift, there we go, JR Swift, we're going to create that. So now we have a new, a new company, blah, 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 excellent. So let's get some vehicles being made for that. So let's go to uh, office, we're going to go to R&D department. Now we don't actually, I've been looking into this, someone mentioned this in the comments and I have been looking into it. We don't actually have to make our own, we could outsource an engine. So if we go to engines, uh, we go to all companies. Um, these are the engines available. Is that right? I'm guessing so. Oh, there's more pages. Okay. So let's go up a couple of pages. Does it get more expensive? Let's go to the last page and see where that takes us. So that is... Mm, I suppose we should look at the price, really. That's going to tell us... Torque 500, power 307 horsepower. And it's still not that much power. Hmm. Do you know what? We should just make our own. I have actually listed some of ours on here. So if we go to uh, vehicles, we've got the Gable listed on there. I'm going for the, the ones that's not really... That we're going to be phasing out. I just wanted to test the market in all fairness. 
So if I press agree on the Sam and see what happens. We'll see what happens with that. We've got um, engines. Um, people have actually done this one. We have made some money on the JR57C, which is nice because we need to make some money off it. Um, I'm not going to do a great deal of letting people use my stuff, but I am going to design an engine for our new company. It's going to probably cost us a bit more. We're going to go a V8. We're going to go gasoline. We're going to go... <sighs> probably that one, in all fairness, because it's the best. I'm hoping this, this is going to go in a sports car, so we can use it for our sporting image. Let's get them in the races. Rather than using our JR motors, we can use JR Swift. Right, power stage one. Design's hard, what is it? Let's just go supercharger then, there we go. We're gonna go layout, performance, technology, design, focus. Now we want quite a good engine. So yes, it's gonna cost us a bit of money. I say a bit of money, it's going to cost us a lot of money. Um, how big do we wanna go? Let's say we went up to there, what does that take us? That takes us to 185 horsepower. Estimated materials is a lot. I um, wonder if I can get this up. If I get these onto 100, what does that give us? Length 40, whip 35, 200 horsepower. That's not bad. We can work with that. I'm not going to try and sk skim money off the top here. These are going to be expensive vehicles. Uh, revolutions. That puts up power, right? So 260 horsepower. If I go right, <laughs> this is going to be really expensive. Um, let's reduce that slightly. Let's get it to about 250. Um, maximum torque, we got 353. I think that's good. What if I match it up? 383, so that's quite a good engine. Uh, fuel economy does not matter in the slightest because this is all about racing. Uh, material quality. I think all this can stay the same. Focus on fuel economy can go down. Focus on performance can go up. Um, we need to... Fuel economy is down, engine torque, that's fine. Uh, development pace, what are we on? 11 months, and that's going to cost us a lot of money. So if we go down to 16 months? No, I want it under... Let's go 17. Oh, wait, wait, where's 17 gone? Do you know what? We'll go 16 months. That's going to cost us 1.1 million pound project cost. Um, the engine is going to cost us a lot of money, but the aim is to have a really good engine for racing, and that's what the intention is. So let's go build. We're going to call this... Um, wait, let me change that one first. So this is a Swift. We're going to call it the JR... Or oh, oh, we're going to call it a Swift... A Swift V8. There we go. We're going to call it a Swift V8. We need to build a chassis for that. So I think the best one we've got is still that one. Let me just check. We should do some research as well. We're not actually putting any money into research. I'm going to go front mid-engine rear-wheel drive, I think. Is that good? What's good for racing cars? Not that. Not that. None of these, really, in all fairness. Um, no, racing cars doesn't appear on here. So we're going to go FMR. What's that? Rear mid-engine, rear wheel drive. No, 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 no. We're going to go front mid-engine. Or oh, what's that? Mid-engine, front-wheel drive. No. That one, that's what we're going for. Is it? Is it? Front-engine, rear-wheel drive. Yeah, we're going to go with that one. Um, <coughs> so, double wishbones is good. That one is worse, although it's cheaper to produce. So let's go double wishbone. We want this car to be one of the best, so frame dimension, suspension design, and quality. There we go. Move those down. 
next we need to select wait now let me carry on moving these down select our engine that we're going to use that's the swift v8 there we go um so we definitely need to make it wider and longer and we'll put the engine area what it'll support size wise we're going to put that right up so it's it's a bit more usable rather than having one chassis one engine um what have we got all pretty good how much is that costing us 527 now if we look at previous chassis um 392 was the last one so that's quite a lot more but i think we're gonna go with it we're just gonna spend some money um let's call that um swift v8 there we go we should choose the company so that's for the swift build and finally they need a gearbox now i know we're spending a lot of money here but needs must we're going to go manual that's for what we want for sports we're going to go um six gear and we're going to go like that again spending a lot of money select the engine um the v8 is what we're going for design cannot handle swift v8 torque all right, well, I'm going for it. We're, we're, we're getting to that point. Give me a chance. Try increasing torque support to avoid penalties. Uh, okay, so where are we? We want top speed, high. Low end gearing, torque. Okay. But then if I go that way for torque, it will... Ah, okay, so let's see. Maximum torque. Design works perfect with the Swift V8. That's nice. Um, can I get it? Ah, so just over 500. That's a lot of money. But I'm sure some of our gearboxes have been quite dear, haven't they? 427 is our last gearbox. So why not? Let's go for it. Um, let's knock that up a little bit more. I think this is all good. Uh, what do we want? Fuel economy can go down. Performance focus can go up. Shifting ease can go up. Wow, this is going to be quite an expensive component, but it may be worth it. Uh, durability, uh, dependability, is that important, do we think? I'm going to say no. Oh, maybe. Oh, decisions. Oh, wow, dependability really throws the price up. It goes from 672 up to 829. So that's quite a lot. Uh, we're going to go with that. So that's around 672. Uh, development pace. Let's get that down to 17, was it? Do, do, do. 16. So we're doing it in 16 months. There we go. Lovely. That's going to cost us about a million pounds. That's how it goes. Oh, well. So we're going to choose the Swift. Um, we're going to call it the Swift swift v8 so we know it's all one set so there we go and that's pretty much done so we've spent a bit of money there um fingers crossed it doesn't work out too bad what have we got going on up here we've got that's our pieces that's our chassis which we're going to use in the future um and the van's going to take five months so let's skip forward two months hopefully we'll get some of those contracts come through we are making a profit still, even though we're doing all of that work. Uh, vehicle sales. The Swift is killing it. 601 units. And that is all down to um, contracts. Swift, Swift. Gable, Swift, Swift. Look at that. Um, we should probably see if there's any new... Let's have a look here. Stock report. Gain. Available shares notification. Monthly racing report. We're doing just as well as ever from the looks of it. Monthly racing report. We got 29 points in the American. Oh, we definitely need a new vehicle in there. Um, I even tried putting the new monthly racing report. Um, let's just delete all of those. There we go. I am going to go and have a look at contracts just to make sure there's no more contracts I can take. Any of those will do. Let's just choose all. Oh, there was a green one. You're after what? You're after the Swift. So that one's cheaper. But it's under development. 
So we could offer you that one. How many do you want? Eight per month. Okay, that's fine. Let's do something stupid like um, four, five, seven, nine. There we go. Let's see what you think about that. You either take it or you don't take it. I don't mind either way. Um, right. Let's go. When's the van done? The van is done three months. So let's skip forward three months because there's not a lot going to happen. Our money is probably going to go up and down a little bit. Um, it's actually going up. We're on 40 million. Now we're down to 39 because we lost 118,000. Up and down a bit. Uh, we need to get some more decent cars. These cars are a bit meh. Um, what are we making? So racing income, nothing. Racing outgoings, nothing. So that's fine. That suits me. Um, how is our city sales doing? Okay, so London's losing, but they are producing all the vehicles. So the two that's on minus figures are producing vehicles. Paris has been doing rubbish recently. Why? Maybe we need to recondition. So let's go to uh, auto commands. We're going to go... Wait, it's on here, isn't it? Replace model. Recondition. Recondition everything. There we go. Um, we should probably look at getting new vehicles for JR Motors as well. I just want to get some of these out. Let's get our chassis done first. So we've got the new van. So we can go to branches. We can go and choose... Um, that one the swift x uh we can apply to all where does that come in the running 42 and 39 and massively cheaper than almost everything else on the market so <laughs> that can't be a bad thing right i bet the review's rubbish uh do you like the swift x do you like our x series um let's go i'm not Uh, the van's an underperformer on the track. Sorry, I got distracted then. Um, let's go to conclusion. Hello. It's not designed for a track anyway. Some may be able to point... Um, may not be everything for everyone, but it is certainly something for someone. I hate that review. It doesn't tell you anything. It's just like, ah, yeah, it's, it's, it's a vehicle. Some people may like it, some people may not. So let's see how it did. Uh, the Swift X sold 136. Okay, I'm happy with that, actually. I'm not too upset about that at all. Uh, the Roadster's doing well. 195. 188 on the Bobby. It is going up. Sales are slowly improving. Not massively, and, and don't get me wrong, contracts are helping a lot. But I have been doing crappy vehicles, really. I've been cheap, keeping it as cheap as possible. Uh, city sales... Again, London lost, Lyon, France lost. So we're producing... Okay, yeah. So we're producing more in London at the moment than France, but the options there, that's good. Sales are okay, I think. Uh, how are we doing on here? Location with new competition, stock report, gained... New racing series available. Um, new contract requests. Oh, we'll have a look at those. Production um, unoptimized. Please review your factory production. Okay. Um, available show. Is that not all automatic? Let's delete all those. Let's go and have a look at our factories. What's going on with our factories? Restrict shipping to the same region, continent. No, that's fine. You can ship wherever you like, in all fairness. Okay, so that, it's all managed automatically anyway, so I don't see what the problem is. I can't do anything about that. Apply. All vehicles. So it's producing all vehicles. That's nice. Um, can we get any more branches open? Ooh, Budapest. Let's open a branch in Budapest. We're going to go there. We're going to build branch. What have we got over here? 144, 800. 
Um, there's not many more that are screaming out at me at the moment. What about you? Oh, you're not bad. I was hoping for something with a few more people. Munich's got a million people. Do you know what? Let's go Munich. Uh, branch. Copy London. Bosch. Because London's good, right? View branch. Design. Why is it down there? Surely we want this up. It's going to cost us two million pounds to construct that. Hmm. Ooh, so what have we have we not got good branches around? Let's have a look at that branch. Um Yeah, see that one's really good. Oh we oh have we been copying London and it's rubbish. Oh that's annoying. Redesign London. That needs to be a great branch. There we go. Let's spend some money on the London branch. Um, what have you? 600, 500. Ooh, there's, did I see someone with a large amount? Prague. Now we're going to leave it at that, I think. Um, let's skip forward. I've completely lost the plot on what's going on. Uh, the following are wishing to renew their contracts. They love the Swift. Fair play. Uh, yeah, we'll renew that. So that's done. Renew, renew. There we go, Bosch. The Swift. How are we doing on the Swift? 591 units. Uh, total profit. That is because we spent a lot on construction with our new London branch and that. Let's go to city sales and see what happened. We sold 294 units. So they're selling a large amount of stock. Paris, France is losing money. But it's only selling 54. I don't understand why it's so rubbish. Uh, what have we got? Contracts completed. Okay. Delete all. We need to look at more contracts. Because that's what's bringing the money in at the moment. How are we doing up here? Chassis is done in two months. The rest is going to take a bit longer. We're going to go contracts, vehicles. Change it to all. Oh. Oh. So, Gear City Cup. Uh, you want a chassis. Two of ours apply. 125. You're willing to pay a lot of money for that. Wow. Um, do you know what? I'm just going to go for it anyway. I'm probably going to get outbid. What else can we apply for? The army, what do they want? They want a compact SUV. So we could give them the new gable. Well, submit that offer. Oh, I didn't see. Seven per month. We can handle that. We want some large amounts per month. 45, 14, 36. Four per month. 260 per month. The, the, the United Kingdom want. So we'll submit an offer to that. Uh, you're after four per month, so we'll submit an offer to that. Oh, wait. Was there a price on that one? There was. Okay, that's fine. Um, you're offering a price, so we'll offer the swift submit offer. You want a gable, so it's good. we're going to say 4758. Submit. Uh, you're looking for how many a month? 45? That's... That's doable as well. 4758. Submit. There we go. Lovely. So we've applied for a few of those. Come on, racing stuff. I want to get you done. We do want to get some more vehicles on the go for um, RJ Motors. Have we got a new chassis yet? No, let's wait. We're waiting. We're going to go two months ahead. And hopefully our new chassis will be done and we can use that. You want to renew 71 per month. Yeah, great. Let's renew it. Done. Excellent. Lovely. Um, 
Yearly vehicle sales, the Swift is smashing it, 7,247. These contracts were amazing. Um, vehicle type, new component design. New vehicle body available. Available shares, delete all. Let's go and have a look at our shares, shall we, at the minute? That one. Um, so if we sell shares, are we going to make a profit? Almost a million pound profit. That's not bad. How much would it cost to purchase all the shares that's left? 20... God, our money's gone down. Oh my God. Um, we're only on 37 million pound. And this video is going on a little bit too long. Um, join me in the next episode where hopefully we will get a lot more done. If you've enjoyed this episode, please hit that like button. And if you haven't done already, please subscribe. It does help the channel. And until next time... I'll see you again.